Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be doing a very special video for the new iOS 8.4 jailbreak. I'm going to share my 10 best tweaks for the new jailbreak that's out. So let's go ahead and dive in. The first one I'm going to share with you is one that's been around the block for quite some time now. And this one is by no means a stranger to the jailbreak community. Spring Demise 3. This works on iOS 7 and 8 and as you can see it's $2.99 what this will actually do it will allow you to even speed up your device somewhat uh, as well as do many other things and we will take a look inside some of the things you can do here you can change your animations your app sliders your control center dock folders icons lock screen notification center pages and status bar this has about 50 tweaks all wrapped up in one. So if you've never used Spring to Mice 3, you are really going to be in for a treat. But one of the main things I like is the custom speed right here. You will begin to notice as we go through this video, my phone appears to be running much faster. That is because of Spring to Mice 3. You also can add animations to your scrolling right here. You have different things you can add, several different things you can do. Um, and those animations are things such as when you swipe through like this, see how my icons tend to dance around the screen. That's coming through Spring to, Mice, Spring to Mice 3, as well as another tweak I'm going to share with you later called Cylinder. So let's go ahead and talk about Cylinder. Cylinder is free. And what Cylinder does, it all, it's also an animation uh, tweak. And it, it is in Big Boss. And it allows you, it works on iOS 4 through 8, looks like. It allows you to add animations to your home screen icons. And it says it has 45 different icon effects. So let's go in here and look and see just exactly what it does have to offer. If we go back out of here and go into Cylinder, you see I have it enabled. Let's go to the effects. And these are all the different effects you can choose from. And I would just recommend that you flip through some of these, try them out. That's going to be the only way that you find what it is that you want to use. So I'm currently going to hit clear. So now when we go back out, now all of that you see is coming from Spring to Mice. There's nothing going on with Cylinder. So if we were to choose alternate spin, now, now look at that. Pretty awesome, huh? Cylinder, and it's free. Much more to that tweet. Next one is BioProtect. This is a fingerprint authentication tweak that allows you to unlock your device using your fingerprint. You can also use a passcode if you want to, but what would be the purpose of having this tweak if you were going to use a passcode? So you see I don't have enter a passcode. I just put my thumbprint on there. It lets me log right on in. There's several different things you can do here. You can change the color of your print. Uh, I'm going to go with the red right here. And we'll go back out. And as you can see, there's a lot that goes with this. So you're just going to have to try it out for yourself. You can protect different applications if you want to. You can protect folders. You can even protect your photos and videos which is very, very cool. So check it out, guys. I know you're going to really enjoy this. It's called BioProtect. And BioProtect is in the uh, Big Boss, if I'm not mistaken. So let's go back in here and look around just a little bit at BioProtect. And as you can see right here, it's actually um, Bio. Looks like I didn't. I had to use a, cop, uh, a copy of this. So BioProtect is $2.99 and I know you're really going to enjoy it. It's in the Big Boss repo. The next one we're going to be looking at here is one called Color Convos. Now what this one does guys, it allows you to color your, go in here and change up your Twitter color as you can see right here. If you want to you can change all that up and if we go in here right now and do this 
go up to messages and now color combo allows you to change up the colors and to do that just hit the edit go to default colors and you see right here you can change your iMessage and even your SMS message to be whatever color you want it to be just by using these sliders so when you get a different color that you enjoy and you can see what the color is up there at the top I tend to like the brighter looking colors and then I'll hit done and that will let me get my SMS colors now here's my iMessage as you can see it's going to be somewhat blue hit done and now details so if we come in here and go iPhone captain and then hit hello you can see right here that it actually changes the color to be somewhat of a purple looking color so it's a pretty cool little tweak guys and one that I really enjoy having another one that goes along with the message app is called conversation pics and what this one does guys it allows you to use your avatar or your contact photo in your message app and you can see right here beside of my uh, actual message that I have a picture of myself and that's coming from that particular tweak right there you can see it's on this side too and that's coming from convo pics conversation pics and if you go back out and we'll go to conversation pics uh, install combo colors right here was a dollar and conversation picks is actually free looks like so definitely a couple of tweaks that i really enjoy using and i keep them installed pretty much all the time another one i use all the time is called repower and what this one does is uh, as you well know we do not have an ios uh, or respring option available so this adds a slider for power off reboot or respring so if i wanted to do any of those three things i could just simply slide my slider over and it would go ahead and respring or reboot or power off whichever one i chose but i really enjoy having that option available to me too called repower now another one that's just come along is called swipe for more now what this one does it works inside Cydia and if you go into the installed section here and you see we could actually swipe to the left we'll get three options Q to remove reinstall or remove and it just makes it much easier to remove things inside of Cydia by swiping and then choosing whatever it is you want to do so it just makes it much better to have another pretty cool option to have is one called twitter plus plus twitter plus plus adds many new features to your ios twitter application and to see those simply go to twitter and when twitter opens up then you will need to go to your profile hit the me section down here and then hit the little cog and you'll get a pop-up that says Twitter plus plus settings choose that here's a list of all the different things you can do list access and main feed share links share images tweet sharing and one of my favorites here is it still allows you to view block profiles people that block you can no longer block you because you have the power over them that's called Twitter plus plus and that's one that I use a great deal. It's just come out in the last couple days. Uh, if you're a jailbreaker, you're going to have to have iFile. It's going to help you to uh, do things that you need to do whenever you need to import uh, different files or maybe remove a, correct, a corrupt file. And another one that's just come out is called Murmur. Now, Murmur is $4.00. 
in Big Boss. And what Murmur does is it allows you to up to interact with your device. Uh, say we were in Safari, and inside Safari, we're going to say we're going to iPhoneCaptain.com, of course. And once we're in iPhoneCaptain.com, say we want to minimize that and open up a different application. So you see now we can actually close that out and scroll, or not scroll, but move that wherever we want it and then still interact with something else behind us. So we could open up Twitter and you see I'm interacting with it and we can even do the same thing with it. And as you can see, I can still interact with these. So it makes it very nice to have. So as far as I know, that's pretty much everything I wanted to share with you. Of course, you need activator. Uh, that's one that with just, you know, it's understood that everybody knows how to use that. It allows you to assign different gestures to different things. Uh, if you don't know what it is, check out one of my earlier videos. As always, guys, if you aren't a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button before you leave. Share this video with everybody you know and keep coming back.